Go. Hey guys, uh, I'm Vlad Vilmi. I'm from Encounter and I'm doing before and after outreach. I'm a sophomore at ISU and I'm just going to tell you my story. Um, I just, I grew up in the Catholic Church and the Catholic Church is, uh, it's an interesting place and, and I knew about, I knew about God and I knew who he was and I understood uh, what Jesus was and I understood the, the Bible stories, I understood uh, the, the acts that you, that you have to do, um, like receiving communion and, and confessing to a pastor or a priest, um, but I never truly understood like who Jesus was and, and what what is it that, that is so important for him to die on the cross for me? Um, so I went through junior high and high school, and um, it was just a bit of a struggle. Uh, I, I was pressured a lot, in, in my opinion, and, and um, I just didn't stay bold and, and firm in who I was. Um, I, I crashed, I, I didn't crash a lot. I mean, I, I folded a lot, and, and I let people's opinions and beliefs about me um, change who I was, and I became a person that I wasn't before. Um, so it, it just sucks to, to think that uh, peer pressure just does a lot to you. Um, and I, I've, I've pushed boundaries with people. I've, I've lost relationships because of pressure. Um, and I'm not proud of that. Um, so I came into college thinking, like, I'm, I'm going to go crazy. And, you know, I got this long distance relationship, but I'm just like, whatever. Like, nothing's really going to happen with that. Um, and I found myself drinking a lot and and just getting sucked into to the to the lives of this, the society and that I have to be with so so many women um, just to complete like who a real man is um, but that's just not true and uh, my second week here uh, a guy came up and, and um, actually um, one of my buddies on my floor introduced me to crew and he said it was a ministry and I'm like I have no clue what a ministry is and he's just like it's just a church religious organization. I was like, all right, well, I've got nothing to do tonight, so I'm gonna head over there and um, went to crew, just a bunch of great, loving people, and it was just absolutely awesome to so just to meet that and just hearing the, the weekly talks and like getting invested in the Bible um, and Bible study was just so awesome and just so true and um, it was interesting. But uh, throughout the year, uh, I was just going to religious the religious organization and I actually wasn't investing in Christ. And um, I came back from winter break, and and I just just realized I, I didn't even I don't even know if I realized just God put it on my heart to just start reading, and I just started reading the Bible, and I just started reading and reading and reading and reading and reading, and I just couldn't stop. Um, I ended up finishing the the New Testament in, in six months, and that was just like an accomplishment for me because the Bible is kind of boring, um, and it's it's tough, but I just realized that He is so much better. Um, and what he did on the cross was so much for me. And he freed me from, from anything that, that I have done in my past. And, and that there's no one that can tell me who I am and, and who I'm supposed to be. Because he freed me from that and he freed me from sin. Um, and I just think it, it's so great to, to understand that his blood is so worth it. And, and what he did for us is so worth it. And I follow him in everything that I do. And I don't say that I believe in God. And I go out and party and drink and, and live a and live a lie. I don't live a double life. I live a life for Christ and I live for Him, and that's what I'm going to continue to do. Um, and I just I love God and I understand that He's going to provide for me even even when I'm struggling, even when I'm in a dark place. Um, he's provided me with so many relationships and, and so many great people to, to keep encouraging me and, and um, bring me closer to the goal of success in in, in Him. Um, so I, I encourage you guys to, to like comment on my wall or whatever, or comment on whatever, or message me. But um, I'm here to take an questions and answers. And um, this is my story, and, and I just hope that you understand that I'm, I'm a changed man. And the only reason why I'm changed is because of Jesus Christ and, and for what he has done for me. See you later, guys.